so I hope you guys can hear me. Uh, Abraham Ramirez, I have it 10 rounds to two. Easy victory for Ramirez. Great footwork. I mean, impressive footwork. I, I be honest, I've only seen him fight twice before, and I've never seen this amount of footwork. So, uh, sorry I'm up close on the camera, but listen to the Ladies scorecards, guys. Going to this is here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena. All three judges are in agreement. Turning in identical scorecards of 120 to 108. All in favor of the winner, by way of unanimous decision. And now the new WBO Super Middleweight Champion of the World, Puro Mazatlán Sinaloa, El Zurdo, Gilberto Ramirez. So I guess I had it wrong. <laughs> 12 rounds or nothing, not 10 rounds or two. So, um... I was, I was speaking with Bob Arum, and Bob Arum said they would have loved to get him in the ring with uh, Gennady Golovkin or somebody like that. But I can totally see him fighting a Badu Jack in his next fight. Um, James Nagel, Julius Irvin just walked in the building. Um, he's about to sit down front row. You know, the first GOAT, the first greatest of all time. Well, in terms of wings, but uh, barbershop conversations. See if I can get a shot of Julius hurting for you guys. Nah, nah, there's no way I'll be able to get it. But Julius, so Ramirez looked impressive. I don't know if he has enough power uh, because I just interviewed Tom Laughlin, Tom Laughlin, and he and he mentioned Ramirez. I don't think Ramirez has enough power. He has the range, but just not enough power. So um, let me know what you guys think. I thought Ramirez looked impressive. We have to see what happens with him next. No matter who he fights, he's a B-side. He don't really have a crowd yet, but I don't think he can go back east and fight. Probably Vegas, uh, Texas, Los Angeles. He has a strong crowd because it was definitely 90%, 10%, and that's and that's being loose. So barbershop conversation. Appreciate you guys' support. And uh, Roberto Duran has a movie coming out late August. Obviously entitled... It's, I know it's probably tough to figure out the title, but it's called Hands of Stone. <laughs> uh, barbershop conversation. I'm sitting next to Louie from Fight Hype. <laughs> Michelle from Raging Bay. <laughs> and we just sitting there chilling, watching fight. Uh, Pacquiao, Bradley next. And um, we'll see what's happening. Barbershop conversation. Appreciate you guys' support. Sorry for the close camera, but I had to get close up on the camera. So you guys can hear my voice. Talk to you guys soon. Barbershop conversation. Peace, guys.